straightforward. You just use a brayer. And I'm using some Gamblin relief printing ink. And it, it's really nice and thick and yet supple. I mean, I can really roll it out nice. You can't see it very well here, but it, I roll it out until it gets kind of a velvet-like texture, kind of little stipply marks. So once I get it on the brayer, nice and even, I ink up the block. And I've, I've got a little bit of, of uh, wood chips underneath this block, so it's moving around a little bit. I should have cleaned up the table, but uh, you just want to make sure you go back and forth and get every little bit. Now later in this video you'll see I missed a little section and I'll show you how to fix that. But So I've torn a piece of paper uh, and it's a it's a white very uh, thin paper, printing paper, and the reason I, I like to do, use the thin paper is because when I'm hand printing um, you can actually see the image kind of coming up on the other side. You can't see it here in the video, it's very subtle. But you have to press really hard with a spoon. I, I have a press um, and I usually use the press. But so this is kind of new for me in some ways. I, I've I've done I do this at demos, and it can be a little tricky sometimes. It takes a little bit longer to do. Obviously, if if I was using a press, I just you know roll it through the press once and it would be fine. Now I missed a little bit of of the front of the block, so I'm just pulling the paper up very carefully so I don't move it, and re-inking those little spots along the edges that I forgot. So, and I come back in with my spoon and and start you know, pushing really hard on that spoon. Now, when I, when I pull up the paper, I'm looking for little gray areas that I might have missed. And there were some around the, the mouth of the one fish, so I have to push a little harder on there. But uh, there it is. It turned out pretty good. You can see there's just a little bit of graying out on the edges, but that's fine. That's just a sign that it's uh, an original print. And I'll be cleaning this block up with just a piece of towel and uh, I use this pizza roller to just kind of squish the towel, paper towel down on it and and that'll clean off the block for the for the new print that I'll be making on uh, Thursday night.